altcoin hyper rally is forming as we speak. We're going to go into the details on the total three. There's also a possible 10x Ethereum leverage trade forming. We're going to show you guys all the details on setting that up. Nothing that we say is financial advice. Of course, this summer we were using the total threes falling wedge apex which fell exactly on august 15th as a date that would pull the candle down and we'd be able to use that to short all coins check out this prediction because the tip of this wedge is right on the 15th of august and is going to have more magnetic power than the sun to the planets right on august 15th all of the altcoins took a sharp step to the downtide you could have shorted avax solana any of them and made a healthy profit but right now this falling wedge has already broken to the upside with an average gain of a hundred and twenty five percent this rising wedge started at 315 billion market cap so if that's going to go up to hundred and twenty five percent it's going to put us right around 700 billion a visual representation of this is on this Fibonacci pitch will bounce right off the top of this maroon zone. Now, this should be taking place at the end of February. Jumping over to the Ethereum chart, as we know, Ethereum isn't included on the total three market cap chart. But when Ethereum starts to run, the altcoins are soon to follow. We can see in white this origin trend line. When we clone it, it fits like an absolute glove to the candle. Of course, this is the one-day chart. We can zoom into the half hour, 15 minute, and this exact trend line will still fit like a glove across the board. Ethereum is testing this final resistance line off of the 2024 peak. And once we get above this white line, there's nothing holding Ethereum back. It's going to start to absolutely run personally i'll be entering into a 10x leverage trade on ethereum once i've confirmed the breakout above this final resistance line not financial advice jumping over to the solana chart we can see a very similar trend line in white coming off the 2022 peak and when we clone that it does fit in quite snugly even all the way back to may of 2021 now these gold lines are another origin trend line of the mitts all these ones down here are already clearly out of play but take note of this when we slide a Fibonacci pitch onto the top three clearly marked origin trend lines, it actually fits perfectly with the Fibonacci 3.16. This adds an extra layer of strength to these trend lines. So right now we're well above these two golden ones. By the end of February, it's my belief that Solana will be all the way up to $1.60 before finding any resistance. Now, we have entered into a 5x Solana leverage trade way back below 100, and we just added on a second one at 110. We're going to continue to hold those until the end of February. Then we're going to cash them out and look to allocate those funds elsewhere. Finally, taking a look at the Caspa chart, when? Is this breakout going to start to form? It appears that it's going to be at least a few weeks away. You know, back in the beginning of December, we marked this golden X on the charting treasure map. It does seem like this prediction was extremely accurate, like every single prediction we've uploaded on this channel. It's my personal belief that this is the most underrated crypto YouTube channel just based on the performance we've had alone. We started out with $12,500, shorting all of the altcoins in April and May, parlayed that into Caspa, did a couple of other risky leverage trades as we went along, and we ended up with just under a quarter million dollars when Caspa was at 15 cents. Can we get a hell yeah? And we're basing it all on this origin trend line method. So back to when Caspa's gonna break out. See these origin trend lines? We've gotta get out of the gravitational field of this one. This is the doomsday one. It's the second to last one, the 3.168. It's the exact same one that during the handle of the cup was pulling it down as well. By the book, based on this Adam and Eve double bottom variation, 
you would enter into your trade once it crossed 12.1 cents then you would enter into your leverage trade that's when it would confirm the breakout my personal belief is keeping that in mind wait until we get closer to this final resistance line right here till we're completely cleared away from the second to last one and we're much more encroaching on this one keeping in mind this red level as well once we make contact with that it should start to assure our upward direction. But as we get closer over the next few weeks, we'll have a better idea on that. Taking a quick glimpse at the one day statistics, this is playing out perfectly as the actual statistics is headed downward. Meanwhile, our fuel tank, our Chanking's oscillator is actually fueling up. This is the recipe for a massive breakout once the stochastic finally hits the baseline and then changes direction, Caspa is almost insured to start rocketing to the upside with a lot of strength. But we're going to cover that more later. Thanks for checking out this channel, guys. Be sure to share this with your trading buddies that are following your picks on Twitter and Facebook at home so they can get the jump on this exclusive charting method. If any of your family and friends are interested in crypto, but they're really intimidated by cold storage, they're like, yeah, 24 seed phrase, I can lose everything if I send it in the wrong direction, get them a Tangent wallet. You can become your own affiliate marketer. Use code Jesse AI. You get a discount and you're automatically enrolled into the affiliate marketer so you can start getting the kickback on handing these cold storage wallets out. Thanks for checking this one out, guys. We'll catch you on the next one.